Hey everyone, welcome back. All right, I am ready to do a little work on getting some of this pollution off the island. I wanna move the brass and the furnaces off of this island. And I have started a little island over here, just a wee little island at La Batale, or La Bate, or I don't know how to say that. We started a small place over here that I'm going to use as the location where we're going to do all of this building at. We are. I have already set this up with a an har a, with a harbor, several storage depots, a small oil harbor because I am going to bring some oil over here for a uh, for a power plant. All right, and then we have our commuter pier and we have a fire station. So let's see what we're going to be moving. We have three brass smelteries. That are working at 250 percent. Okay. Three brass smelteries at 250 percent is far more than enough. Actually, let's not look at it that way. Let's look at all islands. I think we'll be okay with uh, just three of them working normal. And I still want to try to keep this looking, you know, interesting over here. Oh, we also need to move these. We have two of these over here we need to move. All right. I do want to have clay over here as well. Let's see, how do I want it? I think I want to do it like this. There's the clay. Let's put in ourselves another fire station right here. Can I move that over any? No. Okay, that's fine. We'll just move him right back to there. Uh, we do need a warehouse. Because I want to have our brick production over here. Because I want to get it off of this island. Do I even have any here? Yeah, I do. I do want to get that off of this island. Even though it doesn't take up anything necessarily. I'd rather just uh, get rid of it altogether. Uh, we are going to need power. So let's get a power plant situated here. Actually, we can get rid of... Oh, wait. No, no, no. Oh, wow. The clay pit is affected by electricity. That's odd, actually. <laughs> Uh, I wouldn't have expected that. Okay. I think I want to put the power plant right here. Or let's just uh, get it right in the center. Okay. So there's some juice for our island here. And we're going to need to set up to bring some oil up there. I'm going to have him go over and let's have him unload, let's say a uh, hundred. Fine, 103 and then we'll unload the rest in Crown Falls. And we're going to be able to supply that because I have an item did I bring that item down here, or did I? No. Where is that trade union item at? I think I had one for... Oh, that's the oil power plants. Okay. That's actually... Should be okay. Let's unload. We'll go grab that. Bring it over here so we can have it on this island. 
Yeah, get ourselves a trade union built. Your ship has returned to get it centralized. Uh, trade, okay. Oh, that's right. I had him going over here to do some exploration for me. Where are you at? There you are. We'll go up and we'll get a little more supplies to bring in. We'll have some oil coming in over here shortly. All right, so there's the last one that we can afford at the moment. Right now, all of our ships are tied up in other areas. So there's a clipper, there's a clipper, there's a barkentine. I'll send you back to Cape Trelawney to help shuffle things around. Okay, I'll grab some of that, some of that. We'll go ahead and grab some extra bricks. And now let's look under our trade union items and see what we can take over there. Hunting cabins, mines and quarries, crop farms, gramophones. I definitely want to bring him with me. To start. They're just being affected by him, which is actually good. I don't, I really don't want to get rid of that. Um, I will fool with you in just a moment. Let's just go ahead and load up then on some more supplies. We'll bring this over. Yeah, I need to um, I need to find an item that affects. Wait, what happened to your item? What, what did I have right there? I already forgot. Oh God! Oh, I got this guy from a quest. Uh, random resident quest gave me him, Professor Rom Devi. Uh, affects light bulbs and gramophones. Produ productivity plus fifty percent. Provides electricity and occasionally produces pocket watches, glasses, penny farthings, steam carriages and sewing machines so yeah he's basically amazing so i definitely need to get him in somewhere uh where can we do i do i have any room okay so you're at 30 you're doing those to 35 percent i definitely still want you i guess i could go without that it's not uh it's not killing me to have that thing It is out, the gramophone is outside the range of it, however. So I need to figure out some way to get him in the range. Hmm. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Yeah, I need to figure out how to get that gramophone in range of the of the rest of this. We'll have to do a little rearranging, it looks like. But hey, I love rearranging. Wait, how did that all that fit? Oh, this thing right here isn't fitting correctly. I was like, how did that fit, but that didn't? Okay. There we go. That's how it works. Okay, we could do that there and that there. Put him right there. This thing I just have around because if you don't have a pub, they complain even though they don't actually need a pub. They'll yell about not having pub access. It's kind of ridiculous, actually. Okay, so let's take these roads out. Let's get the gramophone factory right there. Or actually, let's do it right here. I think I like this right here a little bit better. Yeah. 
Yeah, there we go. That'll work. For some reason, I want to turn that around. This would actually fit perfect right there. And everything... Oh, no. Now the veneer is not in range. That's okay. I can... Uh, I can work with it. I can make it work. Wait, not that. I wanted this right there. There we go. The veneer was not in range, but I think it's okay. I think we're still all right on the veneers, aren't we? Yeah, we're still fine on them. Okay. Then we can move him back over to here. I'm going to leave him right there. I kind of like that right there. There we go. Now the gramophone will be in range, and we can slot this in. Now let's see what that does to everything. Looks like it's still going to be okay. I don't know why that was at 204. Speed things up for a second. Let everything get caught up to where it needs to be. This is going to go up to 285. It's going to go down to 200. And we will test it from there. Okay, let's unload some goodies. Let's have him do that. Yeah, now these guys are working double time, which means I can get rid of them wherever it was I built them. Where did I build that? Oh, God, I don't even remember. Where did I put that in? Was it right here? Yeah, it's right here. Okay. There we go. Just take that out. A town of dunces. Don't know what you're talking about, buddy. Okay, back to fooling with all of this. Oh wow, he's almost out of oil already. How much oil does he have? He's actually got quite a bit. Let's adjust that oil route then. Oh wow, okay, he actually dropped off 100. Hmm. Okay, so he's in there picking up oil. Okay, so we'll split it in half. We'll do 200 to 200. Oh, he only picked up 96. Oh, that's right. I have one up here. Oh, shoot. I completely didn't think about that. Um, I don't think anybody thing else has oil that I can go set up. This island did, but he has taken that island. Yeah, okay. Well, that just means that I'm going to have to go to the New World and set up oil production in the New World and ship it over. That's fine. I can deal with that. Let's just go ahead and get the rest of this laid out. I wanted one more of these. Right here will work. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on. Let's go this way with it. And we will put one right there. That'll do. Uh, 
Ah, uh, you know what? Might as well just do brick roads. Sit here messing around with it, trying to get the, trying to get them to lay out correctly, and I just need to do brick roads. Get better coverage. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's move that one to right there. So there's three of those, and we needed two of these. Okay. Now, I kind of want to, kind of want to decorate it up a little bit. Oh, I can't fit one in right there. I don't know what I'm gonna do right there then. Oh wait. Oh no 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 I can't. I was like wait a minute yes I can. No 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 I can't. No I can't. I was I was right the first time. Can't do it. Put that right there. We'll just wait for them to get some more bricks. Let's bring you back over here. Let me go pick up some other items. Okay everything should have uh worked out now so let's just look at all items here uh we do need some more wood or some more logs rather that's fine that one's fine that's fine this is good this is good steel is down but we are buying steel so i'm okay with it Sand is fine. It's fine. About out of fur coats. Oil is okay. And we're buying zinc and copper from uh, what's his face? Eli. We don't have to worry about pocket watches. It looks like we're okay on filaments and okay on light bulbs. We're okay on grapes. Yep. Everything else is looking rather nice. Good. Because we're also producing extra pocket watches, glasses, penny farthing, steam carriages, and sewing machines. Lovely. Lovely. Okay, 20. Yeah, I kind of want to decorate this up. I don't want to make this look like just an industrial crap house basically is what it boils down to um before i destroy all this let me make sure i have some brass and storage i do have some brass and storage so let's get rid of those and we'll get rid of those that cleans up the island a good bit so now it's just the cab assembly line and the oil refinery causing me problems okay so now comes the fun part. I've got to transport coal, uh, coal, iron ore, zinc, and copper over there. So we do have one trade route that is pick was buying some of that stuff. So it's this one. So we're going to instead have it go to there and unload all of that there. Okay, because I don't believe I need coal for anything over here anymore, at least on Crown Falls. Uh, actually, no, I do. What's using coal over here then? What could be using coal? We don't have any more of those. Artisans. This is just using iron. What the heck is using coal? In one of your oh, for God's sake. Okay, stuff's on fire. It's fine. I don't know what's using coal, to be honest. I have no idea. I need more wood, though.
Yeah, what, what's using coal? So that's the production of coal. What's using coal? I wish it would show me what's using coal. Wait, filaments. Filaments were using coal. Duh. I'm like, what is using coal? It's the filaments. Okay, that's fine. So he's going to send that over. We're already out of oil over there. That's fine. So he's going to be bringing zinc and copper over. Let me make sure I don't need zinc or copper and I haven't screwed something up. Okay. So zinc and copper will go over there. We'll bring coal over there. And we'll bring iron over there. So we do need another ship. I am just going to go ahead and build a uh, just a standard old cargo ship for this. We haven't built one of those at all. I have not built one of those, but I am going to need one. Yeah, I will. Uh, I will do that for you. I'm not going to use this particular steamship because this is one that I'm using to do quite a bit with. We'll just have a cargo freighter go between these two areas, dropping off everything. Now, the next thing we need to work on is we do need more oil. How is he doing on oil? Is, are we having any trouble with oil up here? No, not really. We're okay. All right, let's go to the new world then, and let's prepare oil. Uh, actually, this right here would be fantastic. It's close by. It's got a bunch of oil wells. I think this is the ticket. Uh, not you. Yeah, you'll work. Come on up here. Actually, you know, there's a frigate right here. Let's just use the frigate. Uh, okay. Let's load up some of that. Oh, we need steel as well. Shoot, I forgot we have to have steel for all of this. Oh, we got 75 steel over here. Never mind. Okay, Obreros. Oh, we need quite a... Oh, we need windows and... Uh, oh, God, I forgot about all this. Okay, well, this may not be as straightforward as I thought. Oil refinery, we'll put you right there. Okay. Uh, Cape Trelawney, I think I brought in an extra ship. Yeah, let's bring you up here to go get some windows and reinforced concrete and steel brought down. How are you coming along? You're almost done. Okay, so steel that and that. Head to the new world. We're also gonna need another oil tanker. Uh, let's just go ahead and queue one up for to be built. Yeah, it's like we're, we're having just enough oil. Mostly because he's uh, producing a little bit of it occasionally. That's the only reason that would, uh, we're able to do this. We'll have one of those to bring the stuff in. And then I think I'll just do... Do I just want to do a basic little steamship? Because all I'm going to be bringing back from over here right now is going to be, let's say, bricks, iron, and that. Yeah, so we'll just do our standard little steamship. Because I can guarantee you this thing right here is going to be consuming a bunch of resources. Okay, so let's get iron, coal, uh, zinc, copper. And let's just do one more thing of coal. Two, 
three, four, five. Oh, we can do one more. Okay, fine. Just uh, do the extra iron then. All right, there we go. Load up all of that. 50 of each. That is works. And then you are going to go from there to there, and you're going to bring back the finished materials of steel and brass and bricks and drop those off at crown falls wonderful this gets us a, a nice dirty little industrial island going that we will fix up yeah so he loaded up 96 so that does give me but that's all of it basically i'm, I'm i don't have any excess So what I'm going to do is instead of anything at Crown Falls, we'll just have him go back and forth between there. And the one that's going to New World will be the one to go back and forth over to here, over to Crown Falls with some more oil. That's how I'll do this. And he is super fast. He's just super slow. I think I might have some items for him. I will have to go and see if we do or not can't remember but we'll find out all right what I want to do now is we're gonna watch and see how this uh, how this goes basically and see if he sucks it all up they've unloaded everything this needs to be upgraded getting all their supplies in and they are producing Now, let's keep an eye on all of this, because this is probably going to start eating through some of these supplies until he gets it back and forth. Yeah, I need a loading. I need a couple of items in him to help with loading times. I don't know if I have any. I have been sitting around like re-rolling constantly to get items. Um, I do. I do have a controllable pitch propeller right here. That's good. So that's going to help. We'll put one of those in that ship. All right. I'll just leave you there for a moment. Ship has entered the region. That would be this one right here. Let's go drop all of that off. And let's get a depot built over here. Okay, drop all that off, we'll go send you back over to here. Hopefully this right here will be enough. There's that. Now we'll set up another trade route between there. Oh, trade route. Wait, no, 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 no. Create route, oil route, from there to Cape Trelawney. There we go. Uh, probably need to put a ship on there. Wild Things 2, that'll work. And we did get a specialist. Who did we get? A former Corsair. Those are not bad, actually. Damage to steam ships and reduced damage from other ships. They're actually pretty nice. I do like them. Okay. Let's unload some of this stuff. Ah, dang it. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Connect that up. Good deal. And we don't have enough bricks. Ah, dang it. Need bricks. Bricks and bricks and wood. Okay, and then we will get, oh, actually, looks like I might actually need to try and go this way with him. Yeah, right there will actually get all of them. That is the best mod ever, the increased radius for the oil wells, because God, it's so annoying trying to build those things. 
drop some of that off. This, uh, I, I believe it's three oil wells per uh, oil power plant. So this right here is quite a few power plants that we can supply on Cape Trelawney with all of this oil. Okay, let's unload all of this and build some oil, some uh, oil wells. Has ended. There we go. That is awesome. Hi. Now what we will need to do is bring some more building material down. Since these things will blow up, and I'm going to need more of it. Uh, no, I'm not interested in that right now. Make sure I'm not forgetting any quests anywhere. Uh, nothing there, nothing there. And Old World, yeah, we're good. Just making sure I wasn't missing any quests, because sometimes I do forget about them. All right, goods. Yeah, everything is going great over here. We have plenty of goods coming in. items okay let's put that propeller in makes him a little bit faster i do need to find one for loading times that will be a uh, big one there's a loading time piece but that right there will help it'll keep him going pretty uh, a lot faster in between the two we'll also look for another propeller for this guy so he can bring material back and forth a little bit faster Now, I would use a single ship, however, I... So here's the thing. You can use an, a single ship, because you can do discard cargo. So goods that cannot be unloaded will be thrown overboard to make space for other goods. Or you can do wait to unload. Those are two options that you have. Um, that way you only have to have one ship on a trade route like this, so... So it is a thing you can do. I just don't like to do it because I see it as wasteful unloading those goods. I'd rather just have them sit in the ship. It's really just a matter of personal choice. I would rather rather this ship be completely loaded up and never really be able to unload many of its goods than constantly throw goods over just to save on a little bit of maintenance and a little bit of influence um yeah it's just it's just a matter of personal choice i guess on how you want to handle that i don't like to throw the goods over i'd rather just have one ship bringing raw materials the other ship picking materials up but of course you can change that if you want to because otherwise then you're going to have just a whole bunch of stuff just sitting out here in the water that's basically wasted. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Yeah. I don't know. I'll think about it. I don't know. Tell me what you, tell me what you would do. What would you guys do in this situation? Would you use two trade ships like I'm doing? Or would you use one and use the throw cargo overboard? Which would you do? I personally just rather use two trade ships, one for raw materials, one for finished products. You know, or would you do, you know, use the, because I never use, um, I never use these options. The wait for goods, discard, or wait to unload. I, I never use those things. I never see the point in them. So, yeah, it's just a... It's just a thing. All right, let's get back to let's get back to something interesting here. All right, there's some more engineers. I don't want to upgrade them. I want to kind of upgrade some of these over here. Let's see. Some of these guys do have electricity, so I'll be able to upgrade some of them into 
I just I need to get some more. Why aren't you upgrading? Oh, canned food. Uh, do I have enough canned food to release that and let them upgrade? Let's check and see. God, we're out of rum again. Yeah, I've got plenty of canned food. Let's release canned food to the artisans. Let them have some. What is the deal with my rum ships? I have two ships doing rum. Um, oh, it's empty. New World? Yeah, they were going from there to there. Oh, well, there's one reason. That thing's been destroyed. What's that one? Huh. Am I not producing enough rum total? Let's take a look. No, we actually are way overproducing on the rum. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Oh, it's going to make them really unhappy if I do that. <laughs> That's going to make them super mad if I boost that up by 50%. Oh, I did get a, I got a thing over here. I just forgot to show you this thing. Show you guys this. I got another legendary. Uh, Cristobal Tafeta, the trans, the trendsetter. Poncho donners bomb and weavers plus 50%, and they occasionally produce extra work clothes and fur coats. And they're producing them quite a bit. So I have a trade route set up to take those over to uh, Cape Trelawney and drop that stuff off. Let's see, where are my... Are they already over here dropping off? Yeah, there was one dropping off. Yeah, there was two of them dropping off. What was that doing with my rum? See, I'm just not getting a lot of rum, though, is the problem. I have, even though I'm overproducing rum quite a bit. Okay, let's go to the new world. Let's go see what we can do about this situation. How are you looking on the rum front? You're actually doing okay. So you know what? How many transfer routes do we have going back and forth between those two islands? Uh, we would have... That's the coffee route. That's the coffee beans. This is my cigar route. Beer. So it looks like we only have one route going back and forth, and it's that one. Okay. Thinking, you know, that we don't need that much rum going back and forth. We could probably handle it with just uh, one. How much rum do they need? Yeah, they really only need a single distillery. They don't need all of that rum right there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take him off. We're going to have you come and hang out there. You, you're you going to go to Cape Trelawney with all of that. And then let us... How do I want to get rum back and forth? Or do I want rum? <laughs> do I even want rum? Eh, it does it does do quite a bit for us? Yeah, it does do quite a bit for us. So we probably do want to keep rum with them. I uh, we could just get a schooner to go back and forth with that. Are you selling anything worth having? Clippers, cargo ships. Those are all too much. Let's just do a charter route for right now. Uh, in No, not the Arctic. In the New World. To go from there to there. Uh, okay, come on. Uh, rum, there we go. So we're going to go from there to there with a charter route. And we'll pick up, let's just say... Let's just, just go ahead and do the full 80. Why not? 
Okay. Do a little charter route. See if that helps that situation. As far as our other rum routes, uh, we've got one more going to the New World. We can delete that route for the time being. He's just doing 50 and 50, and Old World rum consumption is looking... Actually, they don't even need rum being brought up here because we have an actor giving us rum. So yeah, we don't even need that one. Don't even need it. So let's take that one out. Let's see. We'll have to find that rum, sh that shit, that particular boat. I don't know where he's at. I was buying stuff with her. Oh, I did get some more propellers. Okay. So yeah, we'll have to kind of keep an eye out for that one ship, wherever it's at. Okay, so there's the one that's going to do rum back and forth to there. So that'll be good. Now, hopefully, this solves some of our rum issues between the uh, Cape Trelawney and stuff. Because I don't need rum in the new world. I mean, in the old world. We've got an, we have our people covered there. Let's see. No, I'm... Go away. I'm busy. I'm busy trying to think out loud. Yeah, they're covered. So we just need all of this rum over here. And we're running low on it already again. It's fine. Um, yeah, don't want that. Let's publish away. Okay, what's next? For once, something is done, mate. Hmm. All right, so we've got these guys are covered. Those guys are covered. These guys could be covered. Um, I would have to shift things around ever so slightly to get them covered up. Oh, it looks like they want a one of these. I did not give them. Any entertainment. There we go. Wonderful. Now they have entertainment. And we reached a we need to reach a new level. Good deal. Let's build us a couple more. There we go. And we're just going to copy our design up in here like this. There we go. Okay. And then we will end it right here. Another specialist, a physician. All right. I'll take it. Now, let's get a few of these right here upgraded. Uh, yeah, I figured we'd have some explosions up here. But we've got fire stations to deal with it all. Okay. Wow. Now we're up to almost 100. We're up almost at 100,000 in total income. And we're back up to about almost 200 influence. little bit more of the more dense parts of town like these like right around in this area and then we'll start spreading things out i just kind of want the core of the city plus you know we're gonna we're gonna do skyscrapers 
I gotta do skyscrapers. They just look so cool. But we will put some of those in. Alright, I want to go check our rum again. I'm, I'm very uh, eager about the rum situation. Well, and I have to get something to increase, increase all of that. You can go there, you go there. All right, so you did pick up 80 rum. Ah, yes, the bright young sapling. We could also do this. I believe she might sell us rum. So if we buy, tell it to buy all that rum, when she comes by, I think she'll sell some for us. Uh, you know what? We don't need, we actually don't need that route right there anymore. What is that, the brick route? Yeah, we don't need that one. I'm just going to delete that thing. I don't need him. Okay, so that was all taken care of. That's all taken care of. World of map. I don't even know where they went. Were they already back up here? Goodness gracious. Oh yeah, they already went and dropped a bunch off. Okay, good. How much did you drop off? Apparently nothing. Are you even picking anything up? Or did you pick up like 10? You know what? Let's just... These things are way too close together. That's one problem. Way too close together. And we did we did get a rum shipment in right there. So we'll go take care of that. Uh, he's got a quest for me. Oh, actually, you know what? My... Let's just delete it. Luddite. Okay, all that got fixed. Let's increase that now. Or can't, because I don't have any bricks. Alright, you know what? Let's just tell them not to do bricks back and forth, because killing me here. Kill me on the bricks. Come on. You're working at 200%. You cannot tell me you don't have enough bricks. Seriously, man. They have cars. They're working at 200% and still don't have enough bricks coming in. It's a bit ridiculous. Alright, where's that ship at with some of that rum on it? All right, that ought to hold us over for just a little while. Put you up here. All right, now I'll turn you on and let you go do your thing. There's the coffee ship. All right, now we can rebuild that. Wonderful. Okay, now we have a ridiculous amount of rum. That's exactly what I wanted to see. That's all that rum. We're also going to need more cigars here soon. I know that we're going to need that. Our rum has been dealt with, so hopefully we won't have that problem anymore. And we have our start of what's going to be our industrial island right here. Oh, I was like, what's going on there? But yeah, we have our start of our industrial island. I plan on expanding this right here and making this... Uh, I have some interesting ideas for how I want it to look, basically, so we'll see how it goes. But other than that, guys, I think that's it for this episode. Thank you so much for joining me, and we'll see you in the next one. Take care, all.